something's wrong with my stomach. So I let him cry out for probably like at least 20 minutes and I'm like, okay, something's wrong. Assuming he has whatever tummy bug Beckham picked up last night at the aquarium. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. Before I still had hope that the stomach flu was about to go through my family. Now I don't have a whole lot of hope. Good morning, Team Hour. Welcome to the vlog today. Unfortunately, starting off with just a little bit of a sad news, but we promised to bring it back up before you know it. 5 a.m. this morning. Rocky just cries and cries and cries, and he actually has been sleeping through the night for the last, like, maybe months. I probably got up with him, like, twice a month. So I let him cry out for probably, like, at least 20 minutes, and I'm like, okay, something's wrong. And so I asked JD to go get him, because I was like, I don't want to nurse him in the middle of the night. JD goes in. He... Puts him back down, he cries. Another 10, 15 minutes, I go and I nurse him, I put him down, he keeps crying. By this time it's like, mm, I don't know, let's see. It's like a little bit like 5.45ish. So finally I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna get up with him. Like something's obviously wrong. This isn't normal, he's never done this before. I get up with him, no matter what I do, I try feeding him, he wants nothing to do with food. I try nursing him, he doesn't wanna eat, I try holding him he won't go back to sleep like i just can tell he doesn't feel good and i, and I don't know what it is come here little love so then just after six i hear someone crying and it's beckham and beckham's like something's wrong with my stomach something's wrong with my stomach come huh, rocco so he comes upstairs and joins us in our early morning hours and at this point I'm like so tired I can't even open my eyes Because <laughs> JD and I of course stayed up late last night because it was Saturday the only day of the week we stay up late So I am exhausted. j -Bet comes up. We try a hot pad. He says it makes it worse I try some like uh, Hepto like gas relief type thing. We tried um, I, Did I say hot pad? A bath? Everything. He's just like, Mom, I'm gonna throw up, I'm gonna throw up, it hurts, it hurts. Rocky. Just really extreme yeah. cramping. He still hasn't thrown up, but he won't eat anything, he won't drink anything, he just lays in the in a ball. So I'm assuming that's what wrong what's wrong with Rocky. Yeah. Although Rocky's taking a positive change in the last few minutes. Is Palmer getting you? <laughs> Are you happy because Sissy's got you now? So maybe Rocky seems to feel a little better. I'm just assuming he has whatever tummy bug Beckham picked up last night at the aquarium. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. <laughs> oh, so once again it is Sunday and I'll be staying home with sick kids. Oh my gosh. You guys are just so cute. Palmer, can you say good morning? Good morning. Good morning, Rocky. You say good morning. It's gonna be a good day, just not what I had thought. So, Beckham's in, he's in a lot of pain. Rocky seems to be feeling a little better. And Palmer, Palmer, how are your eyes? Still good? I think Palmer's better. So, we're just gonna enjoy life. JD is gonna take Peyton to church because he has to teach his lesson. So, normally we would like switch back and forth who gets to go, but I will let JD go and he'll teach his lesson and him and Peyton will go to Sacrament and I will stay here with the kids. Uh, you, you feeling any better at all? I am feeling better. You feeling a little bit better? You feeling good enough to go to church? <laughs> Sorry, you're sick, Becky. Can I get you anything? <laughs> you're good. Just need to lay here. What? <laughs> what? You're making toast for him? That's nice of you, but I don't know that he wants to eat anything. You can try. You know what? You try it, and if not, will you eat it? Yes. You are so sweet. <laughs> I'm like sitting in the toast. You are the sweetest. This is my favorite. You feeling okay, though? You don't have any tummy issues? Of course, Peyton has an immune system of steel. <laughs> Beckham just threw up every, well, but he, he contained it all. But like, so much throw up. But now what did you just tell me? My stomach really, really felt 
It feels a whole lot better. It was really cute, but really sad. He's like, mom, I feel so much better. <laughs> he just, I, it was a lot. We don't need to go into more detail. Thank goodness he's a big kid and, okay. All right, so moving forward. I'm in the bathroom and Peyton brings this in with him, right? He's throwing up. Peyton had been doing this before he got sick. Let me show you. She made him a crystal light packet, his favorite kind of toast. And look, love you Bex, love Peyton. You are so sweet. I'm sorry, I actually told her though that he cannot eat that yeah. because he'll throw it up. You could eat it though, and it hasn't even been contaminated. Still. Does it make you feel kind of gross? Yeah. <laughs> no one's touched it. I didn't even let him touch it. You just worried after what you saw come out of him? Yeah. But you feel better, you look better. <laughs> You're not like, what, throwing yourself around in pain. I'm glad you're okay, but now I'm worried. Before I still had hope that the stomach flu wasn't about to go through my family. Now I don't have a whole lot of hope. Weird, weird turn of events. I ended up taking a three and a half hour nap. And I can't decide if I feel better or if I feel like trash after it. But I'm gonna just be grateful. Thank you. Judy got home from church and I was like, Honest truth, I have nothing left to give. Between the three sick littles and getting up in what felt like the middle of the night and just staying up the rest of the day, I just really felt like I had nothing. Palmer, where, where are you taking that treat? Palmer! <laughs> she just went in, in her room with the treat. So JD was like, go take a nap. I put on, we're taking white nose, noise, headphones, eye cover, Fan, I like did my best to sleep and to sleep long and it worked. I don't know that I've ever taken a three and a half hour nap, like even when I've been sick. So, that was fantastic. What do you have, sweetie? Nothing. No. All right. So, we are now just trying to decide how to spend the rest of our day. Beckham feels okay. Um, he actually seems to be a little bit hyper, so. This was maybe like a really light stomach bug. We thought maybe it was appendicitis for a minute. So relieved that that's not the case. At least that we don't <laughs> think. So we're just taking it easy. Update j -Bike. how are you feeling? Oh. Feeling good? Oh, good. Okay, why don't you chew that out, mouth closed and we will show them this mess. What are we making? Banana bread. Banana bread. So j -Bike was like, hey mom, can we make banana bread? And I was like, that sounds pretty good on a hurt stomach, don't you guys think? That sounds pretty good. So, we are making banana bread right now, and it is getting way too late. I am no longer like wanting the kids to stay up to finish this. So I made some mini muffins so that those will be done sooner. Banana bread takes an hour to cook, and I need to go to bed before that. So, Beckham's enjoying all the mini muffins, mini and then muffins. tomorrow we'll have eggs with banana bread for breakfast. All right, well we are gonna have banana bread for the rest of our lives. These are mini muffins and they are so good. I'm gonna freeze them. Then we've got these loaves coming out and all of this still to cook. But amidst putting all the kids to bed and making this banana bread, Dad, what happened? Where are you at? He's out there somewhere. Oh. <laughs> Cleaning out my sink. Why? Peyton threw up in it. And it's already been clogged. It was not draining before. <laughs> and now there's throw up in it and it's not draining. I'm so distraught. And it stinks. So I'm getting some some safety goggles and my uh, mask so I don't The have thing is that she even eats spaghetti for dinner. That's yeah, gotta make it so <laughs> This dang stomach flu. And you guys, in the vlog that went out today, we were talking about how strong Peyton's stomach is. Just cracks me up. Poor kid though, I feel really bad for her. So Peyton, come on in here, how you feeling? Good. You feeling better now that you threw up? Sort of. I am happy because I don't have to go to school. <laughs> so Peyton's laying on this side, and Beckham is laying on this side. So luckily we have two mattresses so that they can both <laughs> But I hope me and dad don't go to the bathroom. Oh my goodness, I got laundry. I, I feel so overwhelmed. Okay, you lay down. 
don't throw up again. I think he's fine. I think he's over it. And luckily, it only lasted for him for a couple hours. So I think Peyton will be fine by the morning. Also, what am I gonna do with all this banana bread that I can't take to anybody? Tons of muffins. I'm not kidding you, how many loaves is that? The whole reason we did this was to get bananas out of the freezer and now we're gonna spend six times as much space as the bananas took freezing bananas. <laughs> It's just comical because I'm tired. I'm gonna go to bed so that as I get up with them throughout the night, I can be kind <laughs> and a good mom. <laughs> this is so much banana bread. Okay, thank you for being here. We love you. You guys are amazing. Thank you for being part of Team Hour. Wish me luck and we'll see you tomorrow.